Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning. Myself, Arsh Kumar, Product Management Leader at ServiceNow. Today, I'll talk about a new feature that we have introduced in Paris for AWS Cloud Discovery. Since London, we have released a series of features to enable AWS Cloud Discovery. The major challenge our customer had is that they need to share their master account credentials to ServiceNow. With evolving AWS roles and identity platform, we are able to enhance our discovery platform to discover resources on AWS without any credentials provided by a customer. Now with the Paris, we have introduced cross assume role and uh, accessor account features. Now using cross assume role, an accessor account can assume roles in other member accounts to discover resources. Also, customers can configure their mid server to assume role on AWS for discovery. Besides master to member discovery with assume role, we support cross org discovery, recursive cases, member to master discovery, member to member discovery. All you have to do is to create a custom role and add that custom role to ServiceNow table. Now let's get to the demo. As you can see, I have created this custom role on AWS on this particular account ending in 920. And this particular role has access, read-only access, for these resources. And also I have introduced a trust relationship for this particular role in other accounts. Now, as you can see in account ending 6,000, I have created a trust relationship for this particular role. Also, I have a, I have added a trust relationship for this particular user for using this particular role also added a trust relationship for this particular user in this particular account for this particular role. Now, let me go to my ServiceNow instance. On my ServiceNow instance, I have this mid server. Now I want to give an AWS IAM profile or I am profile role to this mid server so that the mid server can assume this particular role for the discovery. Now I have gone to my configuration parameters of mid server and I've added this particular parameter and I've assigned a value called full access for this particular mid server. And this particular mid server is already there on this AWS, AWS EC2 instance. and it can assume this particular role for the discovery. Now, also on this particular account, on this particular instance, I have created one master account and three member accounts. And as you can see for this master account, which is ending in 920, that's where this particular role exists, right? Now, I have assigned an accessor account, a member accessor account to this particular master. And this particular member sorry, this particular member is there in the account ending in 6000. And as you know, the mid server also there on this particular account on the account ending in 6000. Now, also, I've, since I've created this particular custom role, all I have to do is take this particular custom role, add that particular role in this particular table, cross assume role table, and I've already mapped this particular role to the master account. Now, as you can see, I have given 
the mid server, which is hosted on that particular EC2 instance of AWS. I have given a full access role to the mid server. And also on this particular account, which is ending in 920, which is a master account, I have created a custom role. And I have assigned that particular role to the master account on the service now table. Now, during the discovery, what will happen is this AWS, this mid server on this particular AWS account is going to assume the full access role that I've provided here. And it's going to do the discovery. Once it finishes the, the, this account discovery for this particular account ending in 6,000, that's where this particular mid server is. It's going to assume this particular role, assume this particular account, uh, member account uh, that is present, and it's going to do the discovery. Now, as you can see, the master account has this particular access, uh, accessor account attached. Now, this member account, what it's going to do is it's going to assume the, the cross assume role that you have mentioned here, which is AWS demo, and it's going to do the rest of the discovery. That's how the discovery is going to work. Now, let me show you, let me set up a discovery schedule and show you how this works. Now, if I do a cloud discovery, for AWS, let me call it as Disco AWS. Select an account, I've already created an account. Create a select the master account because you want to discover the master account and select the credentials. You don't need to select the credentials, the credentials, you don't need to provide the credentials, as you know, and test this account. Whether this to see whether the master account, um, you know, is validating val whether the master account is getting validated or not. Now, Just give it a moment. Almost there. Now let's go to the next step of the, the schedule. Now I want to discover these are the, um, the available data centers. Um, I just want to discover, let's say, not all, I just want to like, I just want to discover only two of them, East and Northeast. Go to the next, mid so let me select the mid server. I have the mid server on the AWS. That's going to start the discovery assuming uh, I am profile and let me do it right now. Once right now is 1930. Um, and then finish and run. Discovery is running. It has found eight data centers. Let's see if we find any cloud resources or not. It's still running. Let's give it a moment. And you can see 
these eight data centers. Maybe you can see high resources. It's too slow, still running. Still loading the categories. Just give it a moment. And if you go to advanced view, let's see what we have in the advanced view. So if you see this advanced view, this discovery, I started sending this probes. And see that you see CQ. See the discovery while this particular mint server that we selected, which we have assigned um, IM profile. And um, let's see, we see any items. It's still running. So basically, you could start the discovery, and if you, I, I, I don't think this um, accounts have any resources um, assigned or created. Um, yeah, it's basically uh, it's going to pick up the. Uh, assume role and it's gonna uh, the mid server is gonna pick up the assume role and the member in the mid server uh, account is gonna pick up the assume role and it's gonna do the cross organization discovery in the master. So that's it, guys. Um, um, uh, if you have any questions, reach out to arsha.vijaykumar at servicenow.com. Thank you.